Welcome, 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 welcome. We're going to do water, how this person currently feels about you, okay? Oh, my uh, water element. So let's start off with cancer. Core issue that this person has. Currently, this person that you're dealing with um, feels it's the Nine of Swords. This person has an um, an abundant amount of anxiety attached to their situation right now. Okay, this is their past actions. Past actions. Okay, King of Pents being really, and then the Knight of Pents and the and the King of Pents reversed. All right, so they weren't putting any any action into this, any effort into into this, into their own life either. You know, especially with you, but um, definitely no effort. All right, and I think it's because they they just they feel this anxiety, whatever is going on in their life. I don't even think it necessarily has a lot to do with you. Okay, um. Maybe now, but not this anxiety now, but they put no effort into anything. All right. This is how they're presently feeling. All right. The, the page of pence, they want this new start. They want to come in. They want to apologize. They want to look at things differently. They want a new start with you. They want to give you time. This is how they presently feel. Where is this heading? Where is this heading? <clears throat> Whoa. You know, we got the tower moment with the King of Swords. So this looks like calm is here with the Seven of Cups. All right, you're dealing with somebody who's trying to dominate the situation. You're dealing with somebody who's very intense, okay? And this tower is about to come in because this is where this is heading. You know, this tower, tell me what this tower is. All right, it's the Ace of Cups. It's like you didn't even see this coming. All right. This person is um, pretty intense right now, though. Okay. But the, you're about to have a towel moment, but the outcome's going to be beautiful. Okay. So advice for the future. Advice for the future. Three of swords. Get out of it. Don't let bygones be bygones. Okay. Open up. Don't be guarded. Let your guard down, okay? Let your guard down with the Hierophant. If you want this relationship, you have to let your guard down. You got to let bygones be bygones, okay? So I wish you the best of luck. There is feelings here. This person is it does have a lot of anxiety. They do want to put the effort in now where they didn't put the effort in the time before, okay? You are going to have a towel moment with this person. Um, your best advice is let this heartache go. Let your guard down. You want the relationship? You got to be able to let bygones be bygones, okay? So let's do um, my Pisces. Current issue, current issue, core issue, core issue. Is the fool, all right? This this person, I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I did two without even discussing. The core issue right now is this person putting time into something, okay? It's like they don't, it's like they want the new stop, but they don't know how to put time in. They don't know how to give time, okay? They're a little blindsided right now. Um, they don't, they don't know how to give you that time. They don't know how to have that new stop with you, okay? Um, so their past actions, okay, was conflict, all right? The, they've been very conflicted about this situation, all right, in the past. I don't know how it is now, all right? They'll call, they still seem a little con conflicted if you ask me. They don't know how to give you time. They don't know how to have that new start with you. And I think, obviously, it has to do with a lot. It has to do with the past, okay? This is how they currently feel about you. All right? They don't know whether or not to, to let go of this, 
okay? They, with the Hierophant here, they definitely, they feel that spiritual connection all day, I can see it, but I don't know if they think you even know how to have a conversation, if you can even let go of the past, because this is them thinking that, you know, you're holding on to things you shouldn't be holding on to. Tell me about the four of pens. Yeah, see, justice is reversed. They, they don't think you know how to even balance the scales out when it comes to this situation, okay? Um, so where is this headed? So presently, you know, they want things justified too, all right? But they also want you to let go of things, okay? Where this is headed is, you know, it's the Five of Cups. So what this is telling me is that this person is going to have a hard time letting go of the past. Okay. Um, they've been holding on to things that obviously are unjustified. Tell me about the Five of Cups. This person's going to have a hard time letting go of the past. Okay. Um, yeah. The two. All right. They're going to have a hard time balancing out this situation. Advice for the future. is the king of pence all right it's they want to be able to put time in um they want to be able to invest the time um it it was the king of pence is very committed okay hard worker so it's going to take it's going to take a lot of work and commitment to make this one work that is for sure Okay, because the person doesn't know how to give you the time. All right, they're, they're just so conflicted. They've been conflicted for a long time if this is their past energy. You know, they don't, they don't know. They're holding on to things from the past big time. Okay, so until you guys can balance out the scales, balance out this energy, you know, it's going to be hard. But your best advice is to, to stick through and, and, and be committed. Tell me about the King of Pence. Be committed to, to this scenario. Yeah, it's a reconciliation. Be committed to, to be happy, to have a reconciliation, to make things work, okay? So, Scorpios, 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 Scorpio. Sorry, Pisces, this person doesn't know if they want to... Clear up karma or not. That's a tough one for you guys. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. What was the other one? I had another sign that was difficult too. But, Scorps. That's how this person feels about you. Here's the core issue. Alright. The core issue is, you know, the four of cups. So their issue is right now they're a little ungrateful. Okay. Um, they're ungrateful. Past actions person doesn't know how to be grateful. Past actions, past actions. Or they now feel like the core issue is they feel like they missed an opportunity. All right, so there's some sorrow now too, okay? Past actions, past actions. All right, the Hierophant. In the past, this person did, you know, liked being in the spotlight, liked being who they were, didn't want a commitment, okay? Um, present feelings, this is how they presently feel about you. The King of Pence, now they want to put time into something. How do they, tell me about the King of Pence. How do they presently feel? Um, now they want a commitment, okay? How do they presently feel about my sports? Now they want to give compassion. Okay, towards my scorps, they want a commitment and they want to nurture the situation. Okay, um, the issue is right now they were ungrateful and they feel like they missed an opportunity. Okay, um, and in the past they were very non-committal. Okay, so where is this heading? Where is this heading? All right, it, it's the nine of swords. It's heading right towards anxiety. Okay. Um, seven of Wands. This is standing up for 
they're saying to you well, what this, uh, this person needs to stand up for what they believe in. They need to take themselves out of anxiety because if they don't, they're going to remain guided. Okay. Um, so if this person does not stand up for their beliefs with the hierophant being here, this has to do with beliefs. Okay. You're dealing with somebody um, who has a different belief system than you for sure. Okay. Advice for the future. Um, so it's heading right towards, you got to stand your ground. They have to learn how to stand their ground. Okay. So advice for the future, the Ace of Swords, have a new stop, but you got to be very practical about this situation. You guys got to be very communicative too. Okay. Um, the Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck, you guys got to be able to dedicate time to this situation and you're going to have to be completely honest with each other and communication will be key between the two of you but the person you're dealing with definitely needs to um it will be standing up for their beliefs tell me about the seven of wands yeah the queen of wands all right that not giving up being determined okay Pushing through, going on an adventure. Okay. So, I love you guys. Bye.